Hey there, how's it going? Let's uh, give another shot at this again, why don't we? Let's see if there's any new rumors to narrate for. Oh, it looks like there is snowy pass. Snow is in Lucia. Snow is reported falling in large amounts in Lucia. While the parents worry about the cause of this strange weather, the kids are out enjoying the snow. Sounds like a news report. What mission will you take? Well, we have quite a few missions. Let me try dueling sub. Yo, I've been challenged to a duel, but I'm scared of what you go on my place just we pretend to be me. Okay. This count got. Ooh, a decent buck. Sounds good. What was the gill pay? Look for the info. I don't think... Yeah, they ain't giving me the, uh... Hmm. Yeah, I'm cool. If it's a fee is 300 and I get a decent change out of that, so... What mission shall I take? Sit down, take a load off. Oh, uh, well, let me go do this real quick. You notice nothing. I bet. I hope. Mission Claire doing sub with Horus here, here doing sub with the success. Reward is 1800 gil. 30 points. Cool. Rumors, missions, what mission will you take? Let me... Snow and Lucia, would you please take my children to play in the Snow and Lucia Pass? I'll make you lunch. Please watch out for monsters. Auntie Larsu. To win, clear battle, win... 33... 30... 30, 30 3600 gold, sounds good to me. Choose what to bring on, uh, okay, make sure you're cool, yes, I'm cool. Let's do this. Rank 1. Yep, here goes the guild, take what you want, do whatever, and let me pick this one too. Breaking news, fire on grass, green street. Need help to quench the spreading blaze. Cyro Fire Chief. Win battle 3600. Get a sprinkler and a fire wheel rod. What's the sprinkler for? Make sure you're cool with mission, blah blah blah. Maybe the sprinkler is an item, I think. I don't remember seeing it as a usable weapon later on. Or armor, or you know, whatever. Let's do this. How about it? You ready for this, people? Yeah. Cool. What treasure could lie in wait here? Searching, 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 and I found red boots. Alright, an item! Yay! Snow and Lucia pass. Let's do this. I engage. Snow. How ironic, because right now, outside, it, there is snow, and I'm in no rush to go see that right now. Ice and fire. I'm not even going to remember this. So, I am um, just going to use Thunder because I don't remember what I was supposed to use and not use later on. And I'm setting up it as my better preferred layout, the ranged and casters in back and the melee characters up front. We have to clear these monsters out of here. To win, defeat all enemies. Let's do this massiness. So, this is my, uh, you know, I'm just gonna wait because I'm, I just wanna let the characters, or the bad guys, get close to me before I do anything. So, I don't wanna put any of my characters out there and then put them on the last. That's no good. There we go, I can at least get some attack going on. I was looking into it, I've been trying to figure out what characters I should play as, or, you know what, I also figure out that maybe I should be doing Cure all the time, even if I don't need it, because that is some bonus XP right there for nothing. I don't really gotta do shit and I can get XP. So a quick way to get XP all the time for my white mage. Until I find a way to sit there and just grind, grind, grind for XP. 
I should be doing the same for my soldiers because then they could um get some quick XP too. So they can do first aid. Make some quick right there. There we go, I'm already getting some hits off on these guys. So that's, that's, that's a good thing. Have my range casters do their thing. So I was looking into the character stats later on after I recorded one of these videos. And so far from what it looked like is that the human archer and thieves are the best races for doing that. And the new Mo have the best races for white mage and black mage, considerably. Like, the human was the lowest for both of them, I think. And the Moogles, I mean, they are okay for being mage. But also, I'm trying to figure out what is the best way to milk as much power as possible out of this damn game, too. Like, which characters perform the best? Which ones are the strongest in each of their classes? Like, I don't want to pick a human white mage when I can have a Numo white mage. You know? So white mage as a Numo is consider considerably more awesome, and I'm always going to want a white mage around. I need a healer. It just makes things go by much smoother. Especially now that I know what I'm doing when I play these games, you want a healer. You, there's no reason why you should not have a healer. Unless you can somehow on output more damage than you're going to take in in little amount of time as possible, you want a mage. A white mage. But if you can have, like, uh, you know, an awesome amount of damage output that outweighs how much they are going to damage you. Yeah, it's kind of uh, better to play it on the safe side. Better be safe than sorry. It just makes things go more smooth anyway. I think back in the day when I was playing Final Fantasy Tactics on PlayStation, I wasn't aware of this. I didn't even pay attention half the time. I don't even think I had a white mage. Maybe I did, but I just remember having all damage output and casters and... I remember I had a dragoon. I don't know if I'm gonna have a dragoon in here. Not with the banga, I'm not sure. I'm not sure what I want to do with my banga over there. And what is she, a Vera? Yeah, she's not as good of an archer as a human archer. But I do I think I do wanna go an assassin with her. I think it's an assassin. Cause she might be pretty awesome at that, although I think that might be range too, so that's kind of a sad name. So it seems like I should be going fencer with her. But I don't like a, a later um, later class that it evolves to, I can't recall what those are. But the Benga seems to have some okay class that it, it evolves into. I have to look into that a bit more, because nowadays I like to, when I play these games, I like to actually research classes so I can get the best output out of them. Like, which stat should I focus on the most? This actually keeps it kind of basic with like, you know, magic power and magic resistance and, you know, attack power and resistance. I mean, that's pretty basic. Nowadays, they made it all complex with like, especially in these MMOs, ever since I got into WoW, it's made me like super stat, um, oriented, I would think, because, you know, it's being a tank, you want to stack all that stamina and strength, you know? 
How are you gonna last otherwise? How are you gonna tank a, for a, a group? Or how are you gonna output enough damage? Or how are you gonna make sure that at the crucial moments when you need to, to knock off some group saving heals or, you know, a heal that will save the entire, you know, round, then, you know, you want to know you have that little extra oomph that is provided by races or classes or whatever. Because, uh, what was it, the last tactical game I actually did play, I had a lot of fun with it, too. It was time-consuming as well. I did spend many hours grinding alone. But it was Gene Dark. Gene Dark. However you, however you would pronounce that, say it. John Dark. I forget. I remember they did pronounce it a couple of times within the game itself, like vocally. John Dark. Yeah, I think it was like Jan. Like Jan Dark. If I am correct. That was a fun tactical game, and I mean, actually, like, after that, it just gets so boring at a point, but it has to be something itself that makes it fun and keeps it fun, and makes it worth continuing playing. So this is one of the games that makes it worth playing these games for. Things should be safe now. Like, this is coming to an end real soon. It's about time we brought these kids back from home. Oh, brought these kids back home. Mission cleared. Yay. Alright, Snow and Lucia cleared. They get all kinds of good stuff. Wars Mastered First Aid. And a uh, new unit seeks membership in the clan. Okay, Estevan. Animus. Okay, I can't do anything other than say, okay, you're in. Okay, for the moment, thanks for watching, like the video, subscribe, and all that good stuff, you know, and I let them in eventually, and thanks for watching, I shall see you when I see you, peace.